Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's 23rd March 2025 and the latest season of IPL cricket tournament has started. It's an annual tournament and it's quite popular especially in India and other cricket playing nations. So I was just thinking about analyzing some IPL related data sets and I came across this data set on Kaggle. So this data set seems to be quite a comprehensive one. It has ball by ball information for all the matches right from the very beginning 2008 till the last season 2024. So I downloaded the data and uploaded it on a Collab notebook. Then I uh, came across one new feature in Collab. So let me show you. So if you open the side panel, here you'll find this uh, blue colored box and you can read that. It says, analyze your files with code written by Gemini. So we all know Gemini is a AI model from Google and I think they have integrated Gemini with Collab. And I also did some quick research on this new feature. So this is basically a native AI agent available right in Google Collab notebooks. So you don't have to worry about any API. You don't have to worry about paying for any large language model. You can use this AI agent for free, I guess. All you have to do is upload your files or data sets and give it a prompt and it will do the job. It will execute the code for you. So what I did, I downloaded the IPL data set and now I will upload that data uh, to this AI agent. Let me click on upload and then I will select the data set. So these are the two files that I will be working with. Both are CSV files. The matches data, it contains match related information, for example, who won the match, which teams were part of the match, what was the venue, what was the outcome, things like that. And then we have this deliveries data set. It contains ball by ball information for all the matches. And over here, I will be using a prompt that I will pass to this AI agent. Okay. And ask this agent to perform uh, some data analysis and find out some interesting insights. So let me show the prompt. I'll first paste it over here in the cell. Okay, so this is the prompt and I have organized this prompt in uh, different sections. So as you can see, first I've given a brief overview of the task or what we are going to do, right? So I'm telling the agent that it's a, a sports data analyst and it has two data sets, matches and deliveries. And the task is to analyze this data and extract some insights. Okay. And then in the next section, I talk about the data set. So here I have given brief uh, description of these two files. In the next section, that is analysis tasks. I've specified a few tasks that this AI agent has to perform. Okay. So for example, the first task is to prepare the data set for analysis. So this data set has details about all the matches of IPL, but I want to perform or I want to analyze only one single match. So what I've done, uh, I've asked the agent to first join these two data set matches and deliveries, and then filter the data for this particular match ID. So each match has a match ID as unique identifier. After this, I will have uh, a consolidated data for one single match. Then over here, I have asked the agent to perform some 
match related analysis okay so these are the few insights that i have asked the agent to to find from the data set for example um, here i want to know how many runs were scored in the first six overs in the last five overs how many boundaries were uh, hit during the match in each inning right how many wickets were taken a number of dot balls uh, bowled in the match similarly you can add or change your own insights or your own uh, metrics based on your requirement then in the next section i want the agent to find out the uh, top 5 batsmen based on various metrics like run scored strike rate uh, number of boundaries hit similarly you can add more metrics or add a new set of metrics and over here in the next section on an, in the next task i want the agent to find the top 5 bowlers as well and these are the metrics that the agent can use to find the uh, best bowlers in the match and finally uh, i have specified over here in the prompt that the ai agent is free to use tables and visualization in this entire exercise and it has to present the final insights in a detailed report or in similar format okay so this is the prompt that i will use and i will pass it to the ai agent so let me just copy this and then i will paste the prompt over here and next i can click on submit so now this ai agent is creating a plan and it will share the plan with you so you can go through this plan and if you think that uh, it will work and if it works for you you can click on execute plan or you can give another prompt to modify the plan so for the timing i'll click on this execute plan and here you can see the ai agent has started to execute the plan and these are the steps that it will go through to perform this analysis so it will first i think upload the files in this collab session and you can check that by clicking on this files icon and here you can see that the files have been uploaded okay and over here you can see live uh, the code execution by ai agent so once you have given the prompt and clicked on submit you don't have to touch anything it will run the code it will make changes in the code on its own okay so now it has moved on to the next task that is data preparation so here it is merging or joining the two data set and then it is also performing the filtering now it has moved on to the next task that is data analysis i'm not going to go into the code right you can check it out later i just wanted to show you the process and how this ai agent actually works so it is creating its sub task automatically based on the prompt and uh, executing the code autonomously and whenever it will find the code uh, output um not up to the mark or there is some issue or some error it will automatically find the reasoning right and will change the code in the next cell
and in the subsequent cells it will run the code to find out the insights so for example for the winning team it's trying to find out the top batsman and also did the same thing for the losing team so these are basically intermediate uh, outputs right that you can continue to um, inspect while ai agent is executing or performing the task and in the end i think it will come up with the overall summary or overall report for this analysis so these are some visualizations and plots the ai agent has come up with i think this first plot uh although it is correct but it doesn't it doesn't give any uh, useful insight because this is something that could have been presented in the form of a table then this is interesting the top 5 batters for kkr or kolkata night riders and top 5 batters for sunrisers hyderabad so these are the two teams that were part of the match and the metric used to identify these batsmen are the runs scored similarly uh, for the bowlers the metric used was economy rate okay so these are the uh, final charts provided by this model and then we have the summary and here we have some key findings for example this batter was the top run scorer for kkr with a strike rate of 150 and four boundaries similarly we have um insight for bowlers as well and finally it has also provided some insights or next steps that we can include in this analysis so i think uh it has done a pretty good job and there is obviously quite a room for improvement and i'm sure the team working behind this feature in google collab that is integration of ai agents i think they'll work on this to make it better in the upcoming months and maybe down the line in the next 2 or 3 months uh, i think uh, it will be more intelligent and it will be more aware about the context and the requirement so over here i can see some gaps with respect to what we wanted it to do and what's there in the final outcome but anyway uh, we can always edit our prompt we can give additional prompts and maybe we can you know um, change the output or get the desired output from this ai agent but the fact that we don't have to you know worry about any external llm or we don't have to write any code to you know create an ai agent that's really uh, fascinating all you have to do is provide your prompt and your files to this ai agent and it will take care of everything so what you can do you can take this prompt i will provide it in the description section and try to modify it or you can run the same prompt and let me know if you face any difficulty or if you have anything interesting to share all right so thanks thanks for watching this video see you